L'Oreal's high flying days may be behind them, but they'd still hit a 40 point mark after 26 games, something visitors Twa could only dream of. His stack arrives in a Moustoir with half the amount of points and three from safety, yet at least Patrick Kisnorbo's men ended a five match losing streak with a last minute point earned at home to Monaco, even if illness meant the Australian wasn't in town. Regis Lebris may have seen the limelight switch to Will Still and Didier Diga, but when Lorient only just survived last term, he remains one of the successes of the campaign. Just one win in the last six has been a tough post-World Cup with the departures. Terry Moffi and Dango Watara, Enzo Lefay remains the Merleau's heartbeat. Igor Silva letting the captain take over, unable to clip it in. Two players brought in to replace those departing combined. Though, to get Lorient that early advantage, Roman Favre, Damba Dieng, took his time, but then fired home his second goal in his last three at home. Trois making their own problems. Roman Favre allowed to run an awful long way. Lovely skills from the unknown Lyon player. And a complete loss of where Dieng was from Eric Palmer Brown. Illness meant assistant Peter van der Veen took over the match day reigns from Chris Norbo. Looked on as Lorient looked to double their advantage. They not won any of the last eight matches against Twa in all competitions. Last coming in 2016. Ball across. But no one there to tapping for Labrice's side. Roman Favre denying Dieng this time from Enzo Lefay's delivery. 179th game, the third most capped player, but Vincent Le Goff not finding anyone in the six yard box. Dieng the difference at the break, the Senegalese scoring two times in four, having scored as many in the previous 18. The striker had not lost any of the nine league games he's scored in. The Brees hoping that would continue. They didn't want to leave it to chance. There was a chance that Estac might strike back. Veno Ripa not ripping up the net of Vito Manoni. The Melu fans enjoying even in the Breton rain. Into injury time. They finally could celebrate without fear. The bench going wild for Stefan Diara's final touch. But brilliant setup from Johan Kathleen. Two substitutes combining brilliantly. Diara scored in the reverse fixture. That ended in a 2 0 draw, but this time clinching all three points. Laurent with 43 points, 12 wins after 27 league games, the highest total in the club's history at this stage of the competition. Fortois, second bottom. Just happy, though, to be three from safety.